ο Bradley Cooper είναι κυριολεκτικά γνώριστο στο ρόλο του Leonard Bernstein στη νέα του ταινία Maestro. Μέλη τη οικογένεια του διάσπου μουσικού Bernstein μιλούν στην κάμερα τη Κοσμοτέ TV όπω και συντελεστέ ταινία για τι εκπληκτικέ ερμηνείε των Cooper και Κάρι Μάλιγκαν αλλά και το μοναδικό σκηνοθετικό ταλέντο του πρωταγωνιστή. Μαθήματα υποκριτική δίνει ο Μπράτλε Κούπερ στη νέα του ταινία, υποδιόμενο στο διάσημο συνθέτη Λίοναρντ Μπέρσταϊν. Είμαστε στο κόκκινο χαλί με την Κοσμοτέ TV και τον Μπά και περιμένουμε από στιγμή σε στιγμή μέλη τη οικογένεια Μπέρνσταϊν να έρθουν εδώ για να μιλήσουν στην καμερά μα αλλά και το επιτελείο τη παραγωγή του φιλμ. And if nothing sings in you, then you can't make music. How was working with Bradley Cooper, an incredible actor, producer, and director? I mean, Bradley is is he really feels like he's family. Within five minutes, you feel like you've known him your whole life. He's a very open and caring person. He wants to make sure that that everybody's comfortable, nobody's having a bad day, because that affects the vibe of the whole set. So, how long do we have to do this for? Well, we need to build up a very strong connection. Not a lot of directors can do that with a crew of 100 people, but he knows everybody's name. He knows what people did over the weekend, and that is like, you know, such a such an amazing experience to have as a crew. And also being a protagonist at the same time and director, and giving a stellar performance. How crazy is that? I mean, just the gymnastics that his mind must do is yeah, the guy never sleeps. These guys would wake up and do his makeup, you know, anywhere from like, you know, five, two to five hours before call, and our call was always 7 a.m. So they would be there at 2 a.m. doing makeup and hair so that he could show up and be on set with the crew. It's an inspiration because as tired as you might be as a crew member, he's been up five hours before you, and he goes to bed, you know, an hour later because, you know, he's got to take it all up. There's a price for being in my brother's orbit, you know that. How do you feel watching Bradley Cooper portraying Leonard Bernstein? Well, it's it's surreal to to see how amazingly accurate his portrayal of of our father is. I don't know how he did it. Well, I know yes. we know parts of how he did it, but uh, his portrayal of our father is incredible, and Carrie Mulligan's portrayal of our mother is incredible. So. For us to see them up there on the screen, it, it, it kind of blowing. blows our minds every time. I find. As an actor, Bradley brought every tool in his box to bear on portrayal of this character. Um, his vocal work is incredible. The way his voice changes as he ages. Um, Lowering half an octave and getting all gravelly and, and increasingly more nasal. His physicality, his knuckles. I don't know. How do you get your knuckles <laughs> to act? His earlobe. His earlobe. When, when it comes to the inner world of Leonard Bernstein, what does he bring out? He brings a lot of the energy. We we talk a lot about how he and our dad um, have the same sort of power of when they walk into a room and the energy shifts and it's, you know, they're the center of attention and there's just this uh, kind of aura with, with both of them and we noticed it more and more and more as the film was being made, how much he was like our dad. A work of art doesn't solve the the questions and the conflicts, but it expresses them. And I think that's really what, what the movie leaves us with, is that life is really complicated and relationships are complicated, but we all strive to communicate. <laughs> 